What's up, everybody? I've been seeing a lot of questions on the internet about King Crab Orange, so I figured I'd go ahead and put together a video of all of the information that I'm 99.99% .99 sure about as far as King Crab Orange goes. So first things first, the release date for King Crab Orange is May the 4th. The Prickly Pear Pink, Aquifer Blue, and Granite Gray came out on March the 4th, so this makes sense and is consistent with that. As far as Ramblers go, we're getting the Colster, the Colster Tall, and the Colster Slim. We're also getting the Low Ball and the 10-ounce mug plus the 14-ounce mug. As far as tumblers, we're getting the 20-ounce and the 30-ounce. I cannot confirm the 10-ounce because Yeti usually does that as a store or site exclusive, so we're going to have to wait and see on the 4th whether that comes to fruition. As far as the bottles go, we are going to get all four bottle sizes. That includes the 18-ounce, the 26-ounce, the 36-ounce, the 46-ounce, and even the junior 12-ounce bottle with the matching straw cap. That does, however, mean that we won't be getting a King Crab Orange 12-ounce with the hotshot lid from the website. However, you can always switch the bottle lids. They're all interchangeable. As far as stackables go, it doesn't look like we're going to be seeing a 16-ounce stackable. However, we have seen pictures of a 26-ounce stackable. I think this is correct because we didn't see the 16-ounce stackables in Prickly Pear Pink or Granite Gray, so this lines up with that. As far as accessories go, we did get a set of colored mag sliders earlier this year. One of them is King Crab Orange, if you didn't know that. As far as gear goes, we are getting the Dog Bowl 4 and the Dog Bowl 8. It's the, sorry, the Boomer Dog Bowl 4 and 8. And we are also getting the Loadout Go Box. This is going to be cool because if you've got a boat and you need a place to put your first aid stuff and your air horn, whatever, this is going to do the job, especially if you want to keep it dry. As far as coolers go, we have seen the Hopper M30. I can't confirm that we're going to get the Flip 8, 12, 18, 24. However, we have seen them in Aquifer Blue, so I don't think there's any reason that they wouldn't do them on King Crab Orange since they do have the Hopper out. I do think it's pretty interesting that they went with these different colors for the Hopper. However, I like the way that the straps on the side and on the top are a lighter color it just makes it stand out a little bit so they did the same thing with aquifer blue and i think that's just it's cool that they're not keeping everything just one solid color however if you are interested in one solid color they will be putting out the tundras in solid king crab orange we've seen so far the 24 that's a roadie not really the tundra but same difference and we've seen the 45. I can't confirm the 35 or the 65 or the hall. However, they did them in Aquifer Blue, so I don't think there's any reason that they wouldn't do them in King Crab Orange. And, oh, last thing, I did miss the uh, lunch boxes. Those we'll probably see as well. And there are a couple hats available on the Yeti website in King Crab Orange already. That being said, that's all that I know about King Crab Orange. Hopefully I answered your question. If you had any about King Crab Orange or you were informed about something that you didn't know already, if you are interested in purchasing any harder to find discontinued Yeti products, be sure to check out antarctica.store. The link is going to be in the description below and be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're interested in more Yeti content and news videos.